Hello, nice to meet you. Welcome to Korean Folk Village. Now I will show you middle class noble's house. We are standing in front of a gate, noble's house. The traditional Korean houses we call the Hano. Hanoks are built for people to live in harmony with the nature. And they were made with environment friendly material while preserving their unique beauty. Korean traditional villages usually reflect the geomancy theory, known as Besan Imsu, which says that a village should have water in front and mountains back. Usually, the noble's house comprises of a servant room, master quarter, inner quarter, and family shrine. Master quarter is prepared for the husband only to meet the male guest. It's used not only for children's education, but also reception. A partner-like addition of provided extra room for entertaining. Inner quarters is the space for women and female owner. And in the past, the lifestyle of a Korean men and women was distinct, according to Confucianism. Confucianism is about social morals, is deeply rooted in Korean society. Confucian teaching emphasized the service to parents and the ancestors. I'll keep going. Husband and wife should live separately. Master's quarter was separated from the inner quarter. However, the husband could come to the inner quarter from time to time if it's necessary. The commoners didn't apply this rule they live happily together. Could you guess? There are two people in the room, father and his son. How old is boy? Look like? Yeah, seven-year-old boy. In Korea, a boy and a girl could not ever sit together after they reached the age of seven. Do you mind if I have a master room joke? At the time, there were no electric lights and only stars and the moon in the sky. So it was dark around. The son asked his father that day, Dad, can you write in the dark? I think so. What do you want me to write? Your name on this report card this boy is so smart. Do you think so? However, Koreans don't laugh when they hear the this story. It's a cultural difference. In Korea, traditionally the reasons that have shaped the Korean's way of life were Confucianism and Shamanism. Confucianism would be dominant in the hour layer, while shamanism is the main standing of the inner one. At that time, they worshipped their ancestors including four generations. We hold a memorial service. They enshrined the shrine here. They bow twice a day. Shrine is a very important space in Joseon dynasty because of Confucianism. Originally, the shrine is an independence space, but there is no family shrine here. Look at the tree. There is a tree behind you, the wall or a small garden, which is set in front of the inner corner, usually avoid the direct exposure from the outside. It means that no people inside was permitted. You can think of it as a floral curtain that's a part of a conservative society in Joseon. In a word, hide the woman. Look, look at the wind chime. When the wind blows, this sound relaxes the mind. Could you guess why a fishy feature is hanging down? Traditional Korean house is mainly constructed with wood, which is high vulnerable to fire. As fish live underwater, 
it is a symbol of a fire prevention. And as a fish opens its eyes always, so it gives us a symbolic lesson to the scholars to work hard. In sultry summer, the novice takes a nap holding bamboo wipe. Bamboo has cold nature. That's a good traditional way to overcome the heat wave for men. If a husband dies, they burned his bamboo wife. Look at the door. This door is wide open space in summer. It fully showed open. We call it Bunha Moon. Hanok is a very attractive house. Look closely. Look at the roof. Dragon main ridge, slope, and hip ridge. You can see there are natural curve, which is an expression made by gravity. So it's called the beauty of line. Our ancestors made the length of waves considering the meridian altitude of the sun which is high in the sky in the summer and low in winter. So long eaves control the temperature of a room properly. That's very scientific. Let's look at the feature of the Hano. First, Hano is built on terrace stone, the highest drive to reduce moisture and making fresh atmosphere. Second, the structure of a hano takes our bodies into consideration. One feature of a hano is the wainscot. When I sitting indoor, it blocks a view into the room by the people outside. And a sitting person has the same eye level as a standing person. So, hano takes our bodies into consideration. I have a story. The title is Nothing Happened. One day, a man and a young woman were secretly in love in the room. Suddenly, her mother was looking for her daughter. Where's my daughter? I don't know. But mom asked again with a questioning look. What are you doing? Nothing special. The young woman was already covered in blanket. Her mother couldn't find her. So, the title is Nothing Happened in the Room That Day. Also, there's another secret hidden in Hano. The pillars support the way over the roof effectively. Look at the center of the pillar. The next pillar tears a little to center and make a little higher towards both ends. Then, both ends don't look heavy. It's a remove optical illusion. It's a very scientific structure. Here is a Korean herbal pharmacy. The oriental doctor treated the two bases creative, acupuncture and medication. The medicine are made from various plants being boiled and reduced down to extract the medicine water. Korean medical plants have a marvelous efficacy of a drug. This is a consolation room with a bag of herb and a medical examination room. The oriental doctor checked the pulse of the wrist. I have a Korean herbal farmer's jug. One day, a patient came to see a doctor. Doctor, I have a serious memory problem, so I can't remember anything. So, since when? What problem? Did you have uh, this problem? Wow, the patient couldn't really remember anything. 
Next, I go to Wanyang Lu. Wanyang Lu means play with the sand in a pavilion. Korean gardens are simpler and less refined. So, natural space is emphasized, and they were usually small in scale. Unlike the Korean architecture is alternative and nature in the role, it's not artificial. This is called the way of appropriating the landscape or borrowing the landscape. The pavilion served as a gathering place for men, and it was designed to symbolize the heavenly realm of the sages. At the time, nobles thought themselves as God fairy pronounced Taoism. One day, the nobles sat in a pavilion. Keeping the company books in the morning, the company wine in the evening. Oh, that's a great expression. Master and his fellow gathered to discuss Confucian philosophy and current affairs. Sometimes they had a poetry contest, playing music, and a party together. Here, you can see a pond. Look at the shape carefully. The pond is a square, and there is an island in the pond. Do you know why we made the ponds like this? It's because we believe in the theory of Chonon Jibang, which means sky is round and the earth is square. It means harmony of the nature in balance. Look. Look at the roof. It's very beautiful. We call it Dancheng. Dancheng is uh, protecting the roofs from the insect, as well as uh, it symbolizes the authority of the architecture. So they painted at the palace, Buddhist temple, and shrine. Especially, double leaves is uh, colorful and beautiful, isn't it? We are used five colors, red, blue, orange, black, and white. They symbolize the five cardinal directions. We call it Obangsek. Look, look at the picture frame. Sometimes the scenery makes my heart flutter. Next, we we'll move to local government's office. The local government's office, we called it Kwana in Korean. Today's government office, and it was a place in each district country. A local magistrate served as both administrators and the judges. In Joseon period, we had five kinds of punishment of the criminal court. Te, Jang, Do, Yu, Sa. This is a butt slap to 10 to 100 times. Pillory is placed on the neck of the criminal. The tool puts the stick between the legs and press hard. Then the criminal feels a terrible pain. How about playing the role as criminal? It's very funny. Wow. Backyard is in jail. The story of the Chunyang is a very famous story that's been exported all over the world. She was the daughter of Giseng. Giseng means made a servant of government. She had a fiancé. He was novelist. So, their love is impossible in real life. One day, a newly provincial governor came to this country. He was a corrupt official who gave the citizens a hard time. And he asked Chunyang for bad service. Chunyang is a very beautiful woman. But Chunyang refused to sleep with him after she jail in here. So, Chunyang was a faithful and devoted woman in Korea. 
Next, I will show you 99 section Nobles house. Yeah, you can think of Nobles mansion. The 99 section Nobles house is the most represented of the Korean folk village and has been waiting 160 years for you to come and see. This mansion was moved from Suwon city in 1867. If you think this house has 99 rooms, please raise your hand. Oh no, one section is the interval between two pillars. So saying it has 99 section means it's a big house that the rich world occupies. This painting represents longevity. Look, you can find corridor. It's a connect the master wing and the inner wing. One dim night that the full moon in the sky. A husband of this house was reading a book till late. The full moon changed into his wife's face. Suddenly, he wanted to see a wife. So that time, what did the husband do then? Did he just keep reading? No, 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 no. Credo is a passage that husband can move from master wing to the inner wing without shoes on. Next, this is where the daughters reside and study. When she grow up, and then she will get married. Even if her husband's house is poor, the parents told their daughter to endure it. So, she lived in the roof house. This place a family shrine. Next, Joseon Dynasty had a polygamy society in Novel's case. The female's owner stayed in the inner wing, and the other wives stayed in the inner annex. I have a wife joke. Honey, why are you wearing your wedding ring on the finger? Wife said, because I married the wrong man. Maybe, I think. She draws his uh, concubine. This building is uh, famous for filming historical dramas. It's uh, sometimes used by the king to check the public sentiment so he eat and drink and rest uh, for a while. The natural landscape was uh, embraced and uh, became part of the complex. Its architecture reveal the modesty and the humility of the Joseon elite, as well as their belief that a place of residence must be a natural part of the landscape. The use of low walls ensured unobstructed views of the surrounding scenery. This is called a way of appropriating the landscape or borrowed landscape. Next, I'm gonna so on. The Confucian Academy is today's middle school and high school. Young people were taught the Confucian class and the rare memorial service for great Confucian scholars who were animals to both learning and the virtual were performed. Now, We'll return to 2023 through a small gate. Oh, it's time to say goodbye. It's my honor to guide you. Did you have a good time? When you go back to your country, think of Korea from time to I hope. May the force with you. Thank you. Thank you very much.